Hello babes, welcome back to my channel. I love, love, love when my hair looks like this. And by the way, you guys, hair update. This is me like uh, washing my hair probably three or four times since I dyed it. But this is what the color still looks like. I haven't touched it since I toned it the last time. I'm still happy with the tone of it. I wanted to show you guys that my hair is still all this one color and it's not like crazy light down here and like dark up there. A few things that I've got from Amazon and I actually just opened up a package right now So I ordered a ring from Amazon. This is what it looks like you guys. I am so in love I love emerald cut um, Like that's like my favorite cut. So if you guys want to shop it I always have my Amazon pages linked down below in my description. It is true to size I'm a true size 7 and I like to wear my rings on my middle finger. I don't like to wear them on any other finger I also added a design to my nose you guys and I posted it on my IG So this is still just the IVD like me using the gel on my nail. There's no tips here There's no press-ons. So these are still the gel nails But I did a little design to them with some pink didn't know if it was really me But I'm like, you know what if I just do one color, I feel like I could handle it if you guys want to show some love on my nails make sure you guys head over to my ig i'll put it right over here for you guys i want to thank two love for sponsoring today's video i'm going to be showing you guys all the products that i use at nighttime from them and i also will be sharing a coupon code so make sure you guys stay tuned till the end of the video I have my starbucks over here a lot of you guys are telling me that you're trying this drink and you absolutely love it so thank you for letting me know I'm so glad that you guys like the drink. I this set, you guys, I don't know if I told you about it or showed you guys because I so showed you on IG. But these are two, like I kind of mixed and matched today. So this is a set and then this is a set. So this set comes with these shorts over here. So it's this material and it's really stretchy. And I did a very like no makeup makeup look today, you guys. So I just have like my tinted moisturizer, some bronzer, a little bit of blush. And these are the two from... Um, Iconic London that I showed you guys I love so so much back to this set it comes with these shorts The other thing I want to mention is because I'm five foot one you guys I hate the eight inch shorts like anything above seven inches I feel like bothers me the reason why I hate it is because when we're five foot one and we wear the long eight inch shorts They hit us closer to the knee. I feel like the five inch shorts suit us the best So this is the shorter kind of side for us short girls the longer like biker cycle shorts they hit us like too long, you know what I mean? So I feel like you're gonna see a big difference if you wear the five inch shorts instead of the eight. The band at the top is so freaking thick. Really nice and stretchy. I did get a medium. Unless you like it skin tight. If you like it, like this is how the medium fits on me, okay? Like I have some wrinkling up here so I could fill it up a little bit more. But I feel like the small in the short, I'd be like, okay, it's like really fitted, you know what I mean? Whereas like the medium, I feel comfortable, but I still feel in the set, you know? So just to help you guys out with sizing. And also for reference, I'm a small and small, or I'm a four six, and then I'm definitely a six down here, just for reference. Actual top that goes with these colored shorts is the regular sports bra. So it comes with this one over here. That's the top that matches this. They're both called beige, but this is definitely a cream like a stone cream whereas this is definitely your like vanilla latte kind of like beige color um and then i got the black set in that so these are all from amazon and i found the us link and the canadian link so both of you guys can like shop these so i got the black set that comes out with that same style top that i'm wearing right now and i feel like i had to have the black because i could always wear this as a crop top with like blue jeans or whatever even this one they're just so freaking cute, you guys, even with like a gold necklace. So you can wear them as like workout sets or you can wear them as like clothing, you know what I mean? And again, the shorts that came with it, same exact thing. Got this one still in a medium and there's still the five inch shorts, especially because of my height. I just feel like it makes the biggest difference. Then I got a few shorts, you guys, from Shein. Like, I'm cleaning up so much of my clothes, you guys, because I just... There's so, so, so much. If you are new to my channel, by the way, make sure you guys subscribe. If you guys enjoy my videos, let me know down below in the comments. I always appreciate the love and I always get back to all of you as much as I can. Also give this video a big thumbs up if you guys are enjoying and if you hit the bell, you guys will get notified for all my brand new videos. I got a bunch of like biker shorts because I feel like right now it's just getting super, super humid and hot and I'm not a big short wearer because I don't know if I told you guys, but I'm not really big on showing my legs. But um, now I'm like, whatever, like, I just don't really care. So I got a bunch of cycle shorts. I got these like lilac purple ones. 
and in the past i ordered a biker short from them and they were like kind of on the big side so i'm like you know what this time i'm gonna order a small because that one was a medium i feel like these are like really fitted so i feel like i would have been more comfortable if i did a medium in these just to let you guys know the right like if you get your true size like if you're a small i feel like that's like tight workout kind of fit so if that's what you like get your true size i kind of want like an in between that i want to be comfortable but i still want to be in it so i feel like i should have got these in a medium but i did wear this yesterday they're just kind of tight on my thighs because your girl got thighs she got thighs that will save multiple lives you know what i'm saying like that's how big my thighs are and then i got the tops to match most of them so got this top they're really nice and soft you guys and really stretchy and whenever I want to like wear some color, especially when you need some like motivation or just pump to work out and you need some color, I feel like that's what this is good for. But again, you can mix and match. I can wear the black shorts with this. I can wear these shorts with this. Like, and it looks so freaking cute. So, and you guys, oh my God. Like sometimes the pictures on Amazon do not do like shit justice. Let me just tell you that right now. And I feel like I'm always vlogging here, you guys. But it's because the space is so open and I feel like the lighting is so fire. And I can also sit down my tripod and like do my whole like European hand movements while I'm talking to you guys. So it just, you know, it just makes sense. I got this ruched dress from Amazon, okay? And my family's actually like planning a day out for the day. And you know me, I gotta like plan my outfit ahead of time, cause you know. <laughs> um, I was like, what am I gonna wear on that day? And like, it's so far away, you guys. It's like literally a month away. But I'm already like, I'm extra excited because we've been so like locked up, right? I've been really liking these ruched, even with tops and the skirts and dresses because they're so easy to put on, but yet they make your body look so freaking good at the same time, you guys. So I did get this in a small, small fits me so nice that I feel like if I wanted it fitted, I would have done like an extra small, you know what I mean? But I'll put it on for you guys so you can see. And the material is so, so, so nice. I feel like it matches what the actual like listing said for the product and it wasn't i can't remember how much i paid maybe 25 maybe 29 it has just ruching detail coming all along the sides and then you get your string and the other beauty about these dresses is that you can make them look kind of midi and then you can make them look kind of mini you know what i mean so you can pull it up as much as you want or you can actually leave it completely flat and just tie it at the bottom so i feel like i'm gonna wear that for the day out i love the color so much like this is a freaking must have and i actually placed an order with she in for this but in like black and like another color so i was going to order this in black but i'm like shit you just placed the order with she in in black so you don't need to do that so um it's a really nice cotton fabric hella stretchy you guys definitely recommend this i love the neckline so it's just like this it comes really nice up and high like all you need to wear with this underneath you guys just to make you feel more like in are these shorts that I meant to also show you guys. These shorts are so, like guys, I've had these in my freaking drawer for like years and I'm like, I don't need that, I don't need that. This is a shaper short, not to like suck you in or really to just do much, but it does hold you in and it makes you feel like you're wearing skin, like it's hella thin. The thing is wearing off, like the company is wearing off you guys. I managed to like take a photo and look up the name and I found it on Amazon and guess what? It's all sold out. Of course it is. You know why? Because these freaking shorts are amazing. You wear this with no panties, no underwears, no thongs, no nothing. Under dresses like this. I wore this in my like last two clothing hauls for all the skirts that I wore. And like I said, it's not your shaper short that's going to like suck you in. But it's the shaper short that's going to make you feel so confident in the piece that you're wearing. If you just need that like extra help just to like make you feel in the dress i don't know if you know what i mean but i do have it in a small i will link it down below you guys can also save this to like your amazon wish list or even add it to your cart if it lets you i don't know if it will or not these are amazing under dresses under skirts i wore these with jeans i, did, I was too lazy to take it off like, it made me feel so nice and in my jeans i can't even tell you guys so this is more like if i'm going on vacation like i'm not gonna be wearing this <laughs> like out over here but i got this like cutout dress kind of hard to show you guys but inside out 
I think it's inside out. Smaller medium because I was like afraid how was it how it was gonna fit. I wanted to make sure it covered the girls, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm not trying to have those coming out. But I feel like this is such a cute dress for like vacation with your like nude white or black bikini underneath or close-up of the material so it's not like you're cotton some of the other pieces i got from shein was this top over here this nude top pink one too i did get a short in this color too to match but it's in um my laundry basket because i wore it out and oh my god you guys i love this color the shorts a little bit more of like a raspberry pinky kind of color but I love, love, love them. And I'm not gonna lie, you can go um, commando with these guys. I feel like because, I don't know, like to me, I have underwears that feel like these biker shorts. Like jeans, can't do it. Leggings, can't do it. I got this top, it's basically like a kind of washed out looking kind of black, but look how nice it looks with this color too. Also wanted to show you guys that my place, I feel like is kind of messy and a part of it is because I've been trying to adjust these past couple months. Obviously having my little baby, my puppy, and I feel like it kind of turns your place upside down. I don't know if you guys feel the same, but it's because you change your routine and your space so much and now you have to make room for their stuff. My outdoor plant is over here. It's waiting for me to put it in the balcony, which by the way, you guys, my sofa is coming this freaking week. I am so excited. And then I'll get to set up my whole balcony. But I actually bought white rocks from Amazon, you guys, and I have to find like a good filler to fill up this pot over here i have two things that i have to return from um from amazon i'm trying different like grass mats for her potty and i've also been doing some watercolor painting you guys I'm trying not to yeah of course that would fall well, i ended up painting this um basically my potted plant so i did that and it was so nice and relaxing this is my outdoor rug that i showed you guys that i got from ikea so i just have it over here so i have some shoes over here this was actually the base from my coffee table which oh my god that reminds me i have to show you guys my coffee table because i don't think i updated you guys here you guys oh my god this is such a freaking mess like there's so much shit in here like vases i don't know if i want to keep but i just have them over here you remember these that i got you guys yeah still haven't organized my kitchen okay like still have not found the time to do that also got this you guys which is just like a white board that i'm actually going to be doing a new um diy painting with and oh my god i have to show you guys what i got over here they follow you <laughs> nyla are you freaking serious girl go get your independence look at this look at this what is that what is that can i have a kiss can i have a kiss thank you <laughs> You're such a good girl. Do we bite? No, we don't bite. <laughs> These decorative papers I found at the art store. I don't know how to pronounce it. I guess you call it dessert in French, but I say desserts in like English. But anyways, they actually changed the name of that art store. It used to be called Loomis, but I need like a something for over here. And then I was thinking of redoing one for the entrance or maybe not doing one in both areas. But I saw basically like a very flat white background, just white. And then in the center, it had like a textured kind of artwork. You know what I mean? This paper is so freaking gorgeous. Like, oh my God, are you guys kind of thinking what I'm thinking? So when I saw this, I was like, okay, I can do the white background cut like a rectangle or a square put it in the center and even paint this white this doesn't have to stay black but if you kind of love that black and white then you'll see the white through the background of the canvas and boom you have this beautiful gorgeous like rich looking minimalistic painting i don't know if you guys can visualize it but i can always visualize the artwork before i do it got this one because it's kind of like a rippled effect um kind of decor paper and you can also cut this into a square or do different lines or whatever, paint it whatever color you want. If you guys ever want to do like really affordable DIY paintings, I feel like this is so freaking affordable. But it's going to look like you bought this from CB2 for like freaking $500. I'm not even joking. Then they had this roll for like clearance, um, $3. And I was like, you know what? I can use it as wrapping paper. I can see if it's really good for artwork. So I am going to be working on this and I will keep you guys posted. So I don't know if you guys could tell behind me, but I got rid of my Nespresso machine. And you're probably wondering why. I love that I have my counter back. I was cleaning her Kong and I was also cleaning her lick mat and also her other slow feeder too. I just love this ring. Oh my God, it's so stunning. It's so freaking pretty. I decided to get it off my counter because honestly, you guys, I haven't been using it for probably months now. 
and honestly starbucks is a part of my daily life i tried to make the summer like cold coffee drinks at home with an espresso and i haven't really found exactly the coffee that i'm really enjoying and i was using like all these creamers i was throwing them out but ever since i found this new drink at starbucks that i'm obsessed with it's just not like nothing's just coming even close to it you know what i mean i was just noticing that it was just this thing on my counter and you guys already know me i like everything cleaned off and minimal unless they have to be there so i was using it so much in fall and winter and even in the beginning because i was so excited and it was new and right now i'm just on this i'm gonna get tired of this and then i'm gonna go to something else you know what i mean so i just was realizing i haven't been using it for like literally a few months now in fall and winter you're gonna need a coffee machine like i don't really go to Starbucks for hot drinks, to be honest with you. Like even in winter, I go pick up ice drinks and I feel like my coffee is a big part of my day. Like we all have our things and mine is my coffee. It should look so much like cleaner without it there. So unless I have to have it, that's when I will put it back. Um, <coughs> Nyla freaks out every time I sneeze. Mommy's okay. I'm okay, Mama. I'm okay, Mama. It's okay. Mommy just sneeze. I just sneeze, I go. Huh? <laughs> I love you. Um, see you later. See you later. So before I forget, this is the updated table. It does come with Nyla. It goes underneath here, you guys, and this table is so freaking low, so she has to like crawl. So, anyways, this is the finished uh, table that I did. So basically, these are four waste baskets, basically for bathrooms, and I did get it off um, Hudson's Bay, their website. And yeah, you guys can easily create this table by just ordering like a custom glass top. That's all I did. But the rounded corners look so freaking nice, you guys. Look at this girl. Troublemaker. And my girl is six months, you guys. You guys, I cannot deal right now. Look, look at my baby. She's so freaking cute. And you see, they always come up to your clothing because it has your scent on it. I feel like my hair looks crazy. I just came back, you guys. It is so freaking hot outside. I don't know if you pronounce the store Simon's. It's the first time I've ever ordered from them and they are at square one. Yeah, so they have really nice home decor there, you guys. If you haven't checked it out for my Canadians, I don't think they have the store in the States. I came across this soap dispenser instead of the one that I have over here. So I'm going to be replacing this one. I so my idea was, why don't you get a plate that's almost the same look and like feel of that stone look? And why don't you put it on top and literally it's gonna be a slim side table like it's gonna look so cute I'm gonna do my own DIY table. So the finish of it is like, you know that faux stone kind of concrete, but this is like Yellow compared to this one. So this one's more of a bowl. This one's kind of more what I was looking for Watch yourself. So neither of these are white. <laughs> this is like gray I don't this is beautiful, but you see how it's more of like a bowl? Either flip it over since the back is also flat. I'm gonna paint it to match, and I'm gonna have my super cute, minimal side table. So now I'm gonna show you guys my routine that I do before bed. These things are directly inside of my cupboard that I use every single day. I can't even like say enough about Tula, seriously. This is their so polished exfoliating sugar scrub. When you're scrubbing with it, you still get left with so much moisture. I do this I would say once a week. I should be doing it more often. Of course, this is the classic cleanser, which honestly you guys, I'm gonna be using this to remove my makeup. This cleanser is so, so, so amazing. This over here is another go-to for me. This is on my face right now. This is what's giving me this beautiful glow right now. Mix it with your foundation, mix it with your tinted moisturizer, whatever it is that you're putting on your face, or if you're doing a no makeup day and you still want a natural glow, then this is what you need. The 24 seven moisture, which is what I use on my skin on a daily basis. So this is the beauty sleep overnight repair treatment. It has every single thing that you need to head off to bed and just to like call it a night for the day. This I cannot say enough of. I'm way less lazy with putting on sunscreen when I'm using this one. Most sunscreens, they feel very oily and they feel very heavy. This does not feel that way. And basically you're protecting yourself, but you're also getting this beautiful glow that it gives you too. And then the So Poreless Deep Exfoliating Blackhead Scrub. I've used this about, I think two or three times but I mainly focus on the areas where obviously I have the darker blackheads. If you guys wanna know a little bit more about Tula, they are a doctor founded brand and all of their products, 100% of them are formulated with probiotic extracts and superfoods. Super clean you guys and they're very, very effective. My skin can like really flare up, it can get very red. I've used a lot of skincare products where my skin's like 
leave that alone i feel like these are very gentle on the skin she realized that her patients did so well in probiotics and their skin also looked good probiotics actually restore the natural balance in your skin and they are a natural ingredient and they want you to feel confident in the skin that you're in right now they're not about like promising these unrealistic things they're all about focusing on being healthy you guys and not perfect that's something i even talk about so much to you guys on here it's not about being perfect now I'm gonna wet my skin just a little bit again. I just wanna go in with the sugar scrub on the top of my forehead and over here. Literally like melts you guys, it's like sugar. This, I'm gonna focus it on my nose. My skin is completely dry right now, but I still have a glow. That's because these products do not dry you out whatsoever. My nighttime repair treatment, this thing goes such a long way because it is so rich you guys obviously do not forget the neck ever it just feels like richness all over your skin if you guys want to check them out and save 15 percent off on your tula purchase make sure you guys head over to tula.com and use my code steph macedo so that you guys get 15 percent off of your tula order or purchase let me know if you guys try them out let me know what you guys order and what you guys enjoy from them but i definitely would say at least the cleanser and at least some moisturizer or a nighttime cream to try them out and see what it does for your skin Skin. You guys can tell that my skin is so nice and glowy and it's ready for nighttime and it always feels so good. So thank you again so much Tula for sponsoring today's video. This is going to be the end of the video you guys. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you guys want to see more of these videos, give this video a big thumbs up so I know. Leave your love down below and also subscribe if you haven't and also click the bell so you guys get notified for all of my brand new videos. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see all my beautiful babes in my next video.